Well, welcome back to the cafe. Soon we'll be talking with the Beatlemania boys ahead of their New Zealand tour. First, though, we are lucky to have our talented stylist Trudy Bennett here to show us what's on trend with denim. Morning, Trudy. Good morning, Mel. So tell me, what's uh, what's with the latest trend for spring for denim? Well, we're so lucky. We've got everything. So, you know, denim is always around, but some seasons there's just this massive influx, and this is it. And the main thing I love about denim is it goes with everything. Yeah, well, it does. And it never really goes out of fashion. So what would be your must-pick items? Must-picks? I really, really think that everybody needs a denim jacket. i got a good one. Yep. And whether you go classic, which is sort of like this, um, or whether you go with something that's a little different, you've got lots of variety oh, this that's season. Nice. So that's fun, isn't it? Yeah. But what it means is, what I love is, you know, you can wear this in winter with a merino and a scarf, and it's fantastic and trendy. And then summer comes along, you go to the beach, you go to a barbecue, you've got a little summer dress on. The denim jacket. Throw the denim jacket Goes over the with top. Everything. So that's essential. What else? Do you think a pair of shorts or a skirt? Um, I, you know, I love denim, so I say yes, that is a great idea. But the other real essential is if you are, if you're not really into denim, which is a bit weird, but there's a <laughs> lot of people out there that aren't, um, you've got to have a dark pair of denims because that way, that bridges that gap with smart casual. And a lot of them are lighter this season, as you can see, but really great to have a darker pair of denim. Okay, so a nice pair of dark denim jeans nice pair is a must-have for you. And for me, a must-have is a denim jacket. So those two, definitely. Do you think it ever dates? I, I don't think so. I mean, you do have to be careful. I did have a denim jacket, and I rocked it for about 10 years, and then I went to put it on recently, and the, and the, and the sleeves were quite big and baggy, and I went, oh, actually, that's dated. I need to update it. You know, one of my best buys ever was I've got a Glassons denim jacket, which I've had for about 10 years. Yep. And it's got a slight stretch in it, so it stays looking amazing. And it was Perfect. just the cheapest tips to buy. So what are the best places to go then to get your gen well, denim? Well, I got all of these from Just Jeans. So obviously, you know, specialised denim shops are pretty good at being able to have all this variety. Yeah. Okay, so Just Jeans, great. Jeans West, but you're going to find them everywhere from Max to to second-hand shops, to everything. This is a nice soft feeling one. It is, and this is again what's so nice, is the fact that we've got all this variety. See, it's got a little bit of cuff, it's nice and lightweight for mm. summer, so it's not going to be too heavy to be wearing to the beach and on the summer nice. days. Nice. Okay, now I want your take on something that I've thought long and hard about. What's your take on double denim? Denim on the top, denim down the bottom. <sighs> I personally won't do it. I did it back in the old days and I won't go there again. Now there are some people that rock it, but for me, no thanks. And I think if you are going to rock it, you go with the dark bottom. See, listen to me, the stylist. Are you going with the dark <laughs> bottom and the lighter top? Well, that's how people are rocking it at the moment. Yep. Okay, fair enough. Um, I'm still in the no double denim camp as well, but if Yay. you rock it at home, then good on you because <laughs> a lot of people can. Just not Trudy myself. If you want more tips from Trudy, go to her website, wardrobeflare.com. Thanks, Trudy. You're welcome. Mel.